Hello, today I'm here with a haul from the Bathing Garden. This was from their winter collection. Um, I believe the turnaround time for this one was, I think it's usually three weeks and this time it was like four weeks um, because I, they were anticipating a lot of orders. So I did get it on time. I got it within the turnaround time. I always do. Uh, another thing is Shannon the owner she's very generous with samples and so I have this huge bag of samples <laughs> to show you guys um, I was trying to be ambitious and get <laughs> scent notes for them but honestly I gave up because I feel like a lot of them I couldn't find and so after like probably three or four I was like I don't even know if they're like new or what but I just couldn't find them so I did give up on the scent notes um and then I wrote down a few but I lost them so that kind of sucks I don't know where they are I didn't get to put down the ones that I did find but it was only like two so it's not too big of a deal this is iced peppermint cordial and um it's just a little tiny um, thing even her simple ones are just so pretty and this smells like mint and chocolate I'm getting mint and chocolate and it smells really nice sorry about that sorry if that glare is bothering you I should probably I can't I guess if I stood here I could block it um, okay so that's the first sample then we have Frosted Pumpkin, and this one is good. It smells like a spicy pumpkin. I'll probably save this for next year because I'm over, pretty over pumpkin scents. I have some more that I'm still melting, but since it's a new sample, just, and yeah, it smells very spicy, a very spicy pumpkin. So then we have Winter Tonka and Charcoal. Yeah. Ooh, this one smells nice. This smells masculine, earthy, and smoky. Very nice. I really like that one. Oh. Got my little gingerbread guy. Um, okay, this is gingerbread caramel and pear. This one is such, I mean, she really is generous with the samples. This one's really big. It's almost the size of my hand and so cute. I absolutely love gingerbread men. And this is nice. It smells like gingerbread and pear. Like a sweet gingerbread pear. That's really, really nice. I don't remember seeing that one. Maybe I wonder if I overlooked that one. Then we have Siberian Spruce. It smells really nice. It smells like pine. And um, it's also, it smells like pine, but like there's something else in it. I mean, <laughs> It's just beautiful. It's just, it's a really nice pine scent. It's almost got something fresh too, like maybe leaves. I'm not sure, but it's a good one. And we have Snow White. And I did get scent notes for this. This is white vanilla and red apples. Really pretty snowflake. And it's a really pretty scent. Mm, it just smells like sweet, creamy, a sweet, creamy apple scent. I really do enjoy that one. So. And we have uh, Rockefeller Lights. This is... Hmm, this smells... Fruity? I don't know, I'm picking up fruity. Maybe fizzy too. 
pink sugar pie crust. It's like I have to take it out. I know it's <laughs> this video is gonna be so long, but they're just too cute not to share. Cute little pink pie, and it's really nice. I've never had a a pink sugar pie crust before that I can think of, and it smells really good. It smells like pink sugar, just like extra sweet from, you know, the bakery, I guess. Then we have this cute little thing, um, and it is seven layer cake. This is also, this one's really good. It just smells like a very sweet um, cake, almost like there's a little bit of fruit in there mixed with it. So then we have another pretty one. I have to take it out because I just love these colors. This is um, Cinderella would be jealous. And this one, um, I have had this sample before and I did not care for it. It has a strange, I don't know if anyone knows the scent notes for this one, then you could let me know. Maybe that would help, but right now it just smells strange, like some kind of weird artificial chemical smell. Um, so maybe it's just because I don't know the notes of what should come out, but that's what I smell when I smell it, but it is very pretty. Then we have Old World Glamour, and this one is um, cute too. It smells like clove. I'm getting apple and clove. <laughs> Next we have Pucker. And I have had this before. It's from the Valentine's collection. But this is a mislabel. For sure. Because the last time I had Pucker, I still remember they were little yellow lips. Like this color... Um, but they were they were lips and it was a citrus and this is I'm getting like I'm getting clove from this if anyone else got this maybe you could let me know too because I'm unless it's like a spicy citrus but all I'm getting maybe it's just picking up from the other things I don't know all I smell is clove and it was sitting next to this in the bag the old glamour I don't know it's kind of weird maybe it just picked up the scent and I need to separate it from this all these spicy ones um, but right now all I can smell from that is clove and we have love and madness this one's really nice I don't know it smells familiar but like I couldn't say. It definitely smells kind of fruity, but mixed with something like a fresh or a clean scent. I'm not sure. I'm really bad at this. If you've seen any of my bathing garden videos, you know that I would prefer the scent notes. Harley loves Joker. Very cute. This is, um, I have no idea. Honestly, I smell, I smell coconut. All I'm getting is coconut. So. And then we have frozen hearts. Just got to show this one. Cute. Little hearts on it. And it smells like mint. Yeah. It's like a strong mint. Whew, a really strong one. And then we've got one more sample. And this is Rose Glace. I've had this one before. Very pretty glittery rose. And it smells good. It smells like a sweet rose scent. So the next ones that we have are also small shapes. Um, but I, I purchased them. So we have um, buttered gingerbread, and this is rich butter gingerbread cookie, maple, and cinnamon creamed vanilla. And it's just the cute. <laughs> is it gonna focus? So cute and so tiny. 
and it smells really good. It smells like gingerbread. I get the butter, the cinnamon. I get every scent note. It's a sweet, creamy um, gingerbread. And I did order um, three of them just because I wanted to have um, enough to actually uh, try it in my living room and see how I like it. Next, we have figgy pudding. And it's this really pretty uh, little cake thing. It's almond pudding, raisins, plum, and white velvet cake. And it smells good. Definitely get the almond. That's like the most um, dominant scent. And then everything else in the background, like the raisins and the plum and all that. It smells really good. So. If you don't like those cherry type of almond scents, I don't think you would like this because it's definitely it's the strongest note I'm getting. Then I got um, Clementine and Honey. This is the last of the shapes. And it's so beautiful. Um, Clementine, Orange Pill, and Sweet Golden Honey. And it smells so, so, so good. You get everything. It's sweet, but then you get, um, you get that citrus. This is amazing. I really hope this throws well, because this is one that I would like, love to have in a, um, and I did purchase two of them. I would love to have this in a large clam if it threw well, because it smells so good. So yeah, that is all for the samples and the shapes. So we can go ahead and we'll get into this one because it's giving off a glare. It's kind of annoying. Hopefully that wasn't bothering anybody. So we have Winter Palace. This is a long one. It's French lavender, winter berries, vanilla, pomegranate, strawberries, peppermint, tea, and a hint of pink sugar. And looks like this. Very pretty. This is a favorite of mine. Repurchase. And it smells so good. You get all of those scents. Um, yeah, it's just all of those scents mixed together beautifully. And it's unique. At least to me, I've never smelled one like this anywhere else. I mean, you just get everything. It smells like you get tea, pink sugar. Um, definitely the French lavender and peppermint a lot. And then like berries, like I said, it's just all of them and it's mixed beautifully. And I love it. So next we have Reindeer Town. This is pumpkin tea, spiced chai and cream. And yeah, it definitely has a tea note to it. Like the chai tea is what you get the most. And then, um, I don't really get pumpkin. It's just like a creamy, um, spiced chai tea. And I do like that though, this moment. And then we have pink candy queen. Um, so this one is sweet pink candies, cotton candy, and pink bubble gum. I'm not even sure. I kind of wonder, this... I don't know. I feel like she used to give free um, clamshells if you purchase over $100. And I think that this might be free because I'm thinking, I don't remember getting this and it doesn't sound like the scent I would like. But it is actually, it's good. Did I show it to you? Um, so I'm going to have to look at my, honestly, I think I threw it out. I'm going to have to look on my thing to see if I ordered this very pretty and it just smells sweet it smells like sweet bubblegum candies I think my daughter will definitely like that then we have elf morning blend I really wanted to get this one in um, in a big clam because this is a repurchase and I love it it's dark coffee candy cane chocolate and marshmallow peppermint and this is a really good one it just smells like it smells like, um, you know, to me it smells like a hot cocoa with peppermint, but a bit more, um, 
rich because of the coffee in it. So like maybe a coffee with chocolate in it. I don't know. It's just, it's really good. It's very, very nice and I do like it. But I was trying to um, be good so I just got the, the, the small clam. So this is Mrs. Cratchit's Christmas pudding. It's cake, plums, raisins, carrots, brown sugar, cinnamon, and vanilla brandy. And um, this one smells good. It To me, it does smell like, um, you know, one of those cakes with the raisins. You get the raisin and the brown sugar and all that. So a very um, raisiny type um, brown sugar cake. This is candied peppermint petals. It's marshmallow, peppermint, and sweet rose petals. So pretty. And yeah, that's exactly what it smells like. The first thing I smell is the sweet, the marshmallow peppermint. And then like in the background, there's a really pretty um, rose note going through it. Next is Winter Jammies. This is sweet cotton, lavender, peppermint, and marshmallow frosting. And this one is definitely strong on that cotton scent. Sorry about that. Yeah, um, I'm mostly getting the cotton and the peppermint. I'm not really picking up lavender or like the marshmallow. It's just, it's a very strong um, laundry. It smells very strong and cold at least with some peppermint. So we'll see. I do hope that the lavender will come out a bit more in that just to tone it down a bit. So this is frosty cocoa. This is white chocolate, milky cocoa, strawberries, and blackberries. It's got like some cute little marshmallows in there. And this one's okay. It smells like, it smells like a white chocolate with some berry in the background. What else do we have? So we've got twisted gingerbread, which is gingerbread cookies and creamy spiked eggnog. Cute little gingerbread guy. And that's exactly what it smells like. It smells like, I definitely get the gingerbread first. And then in the background I can get that sugar cookie. Is it sugar cookie? It's gingerbread cookies. Well, it smells good. It smells like gingerbread, a little bit sweet, with eggnog in, in the background. Next is cranberry bubbles. This is... Cranberries, peaches, vanilla bean, cherry, hibiscus, and a hint of bubble gum. And this one is good. This one smells so, so good. It's, um, it's fruity. And to me, it smells a bit fizzy, but there's no... It's called cranberry bubbles, but I don't see where it says there's any kind of fizzy note in it unless I missed that when I was writing it down. But it just smells amazing. It smells fruity and I almost get a little bit of like, maybe it's the peach and the hibiscus. I don't know. It's fruity and it's sweet and it's very, very, very good. Next is frosted fruit cake which is fruit, nuts, cake, and cream cheese frosting. And that's what this smells like. It smells really good. It smells like a nutty cake with like, um, like a sweet, almost kind of sharp cream cheese frosting. It's really good. I like that one too. And we have Bring Me Frost. This is fresh snow, ozone, and frozen air. And this one smells, um, this one smells good. It definitely smells like pine. I wasn't expecting that. I don't know if it's the fresh snow that has pine in it, but it smells like a fresh um, pine type of scent. And it is nice, it is nice, so we'll see. I'm not too big on pine scents, but trying to go out of my comfort zone so next we have cherry prosecco cordial 
which is Prosecco, Cherries, and Sugared Rock Candy. I love that one. And it smells really good. I almost get like a body care note from it. It just smells like sweet cherries. Like a sweet cherry fizzy scent, but almost like a body care type, if that makes sense. Like not real fruit cherries, but like a body care type of cherry. So this is Claus Manor, and it is gingerbread, nutmeg latte, and sweet cinnamon candy. And this one smells like, I mostly get, let me see, let me take it out. That one's got a lot of glitter. I do not want to sniff that. I'm getting gingerbread and then um, it's got some, some sweet cinnamon, or some spicy cinnamon. And like, yeah, there's a little bit of a latte note in there too. It's kind of toning down the gingerbread. Then we have Fireside Latte. This is caramel latte with brown sugar, vanilla, bonfire, and sandalwood. And this one smells nice. Um, it does smell nice. It's, I don't know how to describe it. It's like kind of smoky, but sweet at the same time. It's like a sweet, smoky scent. Definitely interesting. So Then we have Dream Cake. This is cotton candy, pink velvet cake, and raspberry vanilla cream. And this one smells okay. Um, it's very pretty. It just smells... Maybe that top layer is just... I'm definitely picking up on the raspberry. Like the raspberry and the cotton candy. So it just kind of smells like a, um, to me it smells more like a candy scent than a cake or bakery scent. And it smells a lot like that other one. Where is it? This one. It smells a lot, very similar to this. I must smell on the other side. Yeah, so I don't think they're the same. But they're definitely similar. They just smell candy-like. So, yeah. Next we have a snow globe world. This is buttermint, candy canes, salted caramel, brown sugar, and roasted chestnuts. I just love the detail too. Like just the way like the trees, you know, or it's like a little scene right there and it's just, it's so cute. Um, this is good. It smells like, I almost get kind of like a body care vibe from it. Again, I wonder if some of these are Lush things. I'm not really big on Lush because the only Lush we have near us is not really near us. It's kind of far. Um, but it smells a little bit like body care. It's like a minty, sweet body care type of scent. I don't know. It, it is good though. It does smell nice. Then we have Cindy Lou Who. This is lilac, candied lavender, soft powder, cream butter, and sponge sugar. And this has got to be my favorite clam. It's just so cute. It's not even really I don't know if it's my lighting settings, but it's definitely brighter in real life. Like through my camera, it's looking kind of dull, but in real life, it's just so bright and so cute. And it smells so good. It smells exactly like how it sounds, like lilac and candied lavender and the soft powder and the spun sugar. This is really amazing. And if this throws well, this is one that I would love to have um, uh, one of the bigger clowns in because that's... I'm really trying hard not to go back in now because I want I really want to wait and see and just tell myself to, I can always wait till next year and get it because um, I don't want to get one that doesn't throw just because it smells good on cold 
Um, and this is spi spiced eggnog chai tea, which is boozy eggnog, chai tea, cinnamon, and patchouli. It's just so cute. And yeah, I'm getting, definitely getting um, cinnamon and the chai tea. I don't really know that I'm smelling the eggnog or the patchouli. I don't know. Definitely don't really get eggnog. Maybe a hint. A hint of eggnog and patchouli, maybe. Um, hopefully it'll come out more once it's cured or on warm. Um, but yeah, that is my winter collection. I really, I'm so far on cold, enjoy most of the scents. I think my favorites are obviously the Winter Palace. So I have a big clam of it. I really like this Clementine and Honey. And where is that? gingerbread guy that one was really good too this one i wonder if did anyone else pick this scent up because why do i not remember i feel like i would have gotten it because i tried to get all of the gingerbread scents cindy lou who was a good one i don't know there were a lot of good ones more good ones than there are a couple that i was iffy on um but yeah thank you for watching